Jennifer Lopez pulled out all the stops for her Grammy performance on Sunday evening where she paid tribute to the 60th anniversary of Motown. But after the big show ended, the 49-year-old singer did not tie one on with Lady Gaga, Michelle Obama, Alicia Keys or Jada Pinkett Smith, who she spoke with on stage, at the glamorous after parties. Rather, the second act actress went home with her beau of two years Alex Rodriguez, 43. The siren shared a photo to Instagram on Monday where she was showing off her legs while sitting on a four-post bed. The cover girl looked perfect in her white beaded dress and ankle strap heels with her hair down as she took a selfie. Alex was in a white shirt and bow tie as he looked at his cell phone. The caption made it clear there would be no dancing or drinking after the Grammys. They were staying in. At the end of the night, it's just us, she wrote as she added a heart emoji. And she also said Grammys 2019 was a night to remember. Alex also posted on social media. He took a selfie in a mirror where Jennifer's backside could be seen in the background. That's a warp. 8 a.m. meeting. Back in the grind. Love it. The former baseball player wrote as he added, Good night, Zox. Earlier he shared a photo where Jennifer was in costume while sitting on a table with bottled water behind her. He stood to the side in his snazzy, eye-catching blazer. Next time you wear that suit, you're my opening act, he said in his caption, suggesting Lopez approved of his look. These posts come after Jenny defended her decision to sing a Motown tribute. The thing about music is that it inspires all. Any type of music can inspire any type of artist, she said. Talking to Entertainment Tonight, she added, You can't tell people what to love. You can't tell people what they can and can't do, what they should sing or not sing. You gotta do what's in your heart. Lopez dedicated her performance to her mother, Guadalupe Rodriguez who she said filled her Bronx childhood home with Motown classics. It was for my mom. I could cry. It's such a good moment, she said of the show. It's just a dream come true. She was defended by Motown icon Smokey Robinson, who slipped into a snappy scarlet and black suit and joined her on stage for the tribute. Before the performance occurred, Smokey had told Variety, I don't think anyone who is intelligent is upset. I think anyone who is upset is stupid. Motown was music for everybody. Everybody, said the Since I Lost My Baby and the Way You Do the Things You Do songwriter. Who's stupid enough to protest Jennifer Lopez doing anything for Motown? said the record label's former vice president, noting her upbringing in her Hispanic neighborhood with regard to the question of authenticity. Despite the backlash, Lopez gave her performance her all on Sunday night at the Staples Center in Los Angeles. Flaunting her dancer's figure in a glittering bodysuit, she blew through a series of dizzying moves with reliable showmanship. Still more affirmation came from Motown founder Barry Gordy, who could be seen smiling in evident enjoyment in the audience. Jenny from the block also shared the stage during her medley with the evening's compare Alicia Keys for Papa was a Rolling Stone, War and square biz. As the tribute continued, Jennifer leaped up onto a pink piano and lay on her back, singing up a storm as Neo accompanied her at the keys for another star.